There are concerns tonight at Clark High School. Last night, parents and students came to the Board of Trustees meeting to share their grievances about new principal Antonio Real. Mr. Real's changes have significantly harmed the school environment at Clark High. Teachers feel that they are micromanaged. Students and staff feel they are treated without respect. Real took over the position in the spring and implemented new policies, many claiming his management style is abrasive and alienating and now want him fired. And emotions from that meeting still carrying over today at school. Kristen Drummond spoke with parents and students to better understand the issues, and she joins us now in studio. Kristen? Denise and Brian, students and parents tell me drastic changes are creating a hostile learning environment, not only for the teens, but educators. Concerning because parents say half the teaching staff talks about wanting to leave next year. Issues range from a new tardy policy to seeming to undermine the school's magnet program. Many also taking issue with the first line on this card regarding homecoming attire. Parents I spoke with call it offensive and a poor way to address the dress code for girls. Now, some students also complain of being objectified. They claim Real calls girls princess or baby and has addressed boys as bosses. He wouldn't shake my hand after we had talked for at least half an hour and then pat me on the shoulder and called me princess, sending me out of the conference room. That made me feel very demeaned and like that I was not important. Before coming to Clark, Real was a school associate superintendent and a principal previously at Mojave High School. The district says two assistant principals, a magnet coordinator, and two school counselors have transferred this year from Clark for other opportunities in the district. I reached out to the teachers union and the director acknowledges several educators have filed complaints against Real. I also reached out to Real for comment, but no response as of yet. Superintendent Jara acknowledged at the trustees meeting last night he's received emails about issues at the school. He plans to send a team to the campus Monday.